Hey boys. Whoa. Hey guys. Welcome to EV Game. It's your uh, least favorite YouTuber here, and who is possibly sick. <laughs> Anyway, I kept seeing these videos online where people were like, ooh, ray tracing in Minecraft, ooh, check out these ray tracing shaders. I figured I'd give it a shot and take a look at some of these, and I gotta say, like, I have been, for the past couple days messing around with it, I have been, uh, needless to say, blown away uh, by these, not only uh, how well they look, but also by how poorly they perform on my 2080 and my 9700k but that being said i mean i'm only getting 43 fps this this is, is not okay this needs to stop 40 now. frames a second this is with, with the shaders maxed out if this, i if i kept the shaders this is the so much on, cancer so I'd get that i can feel the tumors I wanted to show growing on my back uh, when I and it's out, way down heavy shaders, on me which and it's not okay do, by the way just going into video settings can you help a nigga out options, and just stop this uh, please out. i am just sitting here sweating because my computer has turned into a toaster oven <laughs> Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Just look at my shadow real quick. I mean, that's beautiful. Like, that's gorgeous. And the, the shadows from everything, actually, are just absolutely beautiful. Uh, but the first thing I want to kind of show is the reflection here on... Now, I believe... Yeah, okay, so that's just a block of diamond. The reflections that I have coming off of this block of... I mean, look at that reflection. You can see, you can see the torch, like the animation from the torch. And it's even on the ceiling too. That is so cool. I mean, that that alone blew me away. Then I have blocks of iron here, which are also very cool, but I'll show you those in a second. There's a shader option though, that allows like this uh, always wet look. And that's why the obsidian kind of has this uh, shiny look here, as well as there's another block I've got here. Oh, wait, uh, this polished andesite it also will have a shiny look so it'll reflect like uh torches and whatnot you can kind of see there reflecting you can also see it on the water look at the torch on the water that is just okay so from a distance that is just so cool but also with this shader pack uh, you have the option of redstone and lapis uh, giving off light and redstone is going to give off this beautiful beautiful red light which i'll get to a little later and lapis gives off this super super soothing blue light I think is absolutely gorgeous and there's also a cool little feature uh, with those two different colors of light when they mix very cool to demonstrate some of the uh, light here I have constructed a uh, iron uh, little little iron building here and for this we're gonna grab a couple blocks we're gonna use a block of redstone then we're also gonna grab a block of lapis right there and we'll go ahead we'll place the redstone down now take a look at that that is that is beautiful and you can see it gives off this this beautiful beautiful red light god that music is so loud since i'm getting a lower frame rate why is it still so loud Okay, but since I'm getting a lower frame rate, uh, I decided to keep motion blur on because it gives me the illusion that I'm getting a higher frame rate, even though I'm not. But we've got the uh, block of redstone, then the block of lapis, and it is, this lapis is a beautiful, and like beautiful is an understatement, a beautiful, beautiful blue. <laughs> blue Why? is by far my favorite color. And the, the blue color that this lapis gives off is amazing hey stop i uh, why like i i'm in awe you can actually get uh light mixing so we've got a blue and a red light to give us this kind of nice beautiful um violet uh purple magenta color in between where they mix and what i can do is i went ahead and i already showed you so if i have say blue light uh, primarily and since the light fades uh, I'm able to do this and show you guys if I place the red down you can see that kind of purplish 
that is left behind from the mixing of these two colors. So you get that nice, beautiful purple, which I think is, I, I mean, that's incredible. I mean, it, it seriously is just absolutely gorgeous to me. I mean, I could sit here and I could, I could, I could, I could stand in this all day long and never get tired of it. I mean, I'd probably, I would now. Okay. So like I said, if I just go into shader options, I reset them. I should a much, much more respectable 76 frames a second. Now, as you can see, a lot of things change, like the iron block definitely doesn't look as good as it did. Um, the reflections don't look as good, etc., etc. Uh, especially some of the reflections aren't as accurate. You can see all it's doing is reflecting the uh, light source and not the actual animation uh, or the torch there, just the light source. So. Again, I mean, you're, you're sacrificing, you're giving one up to get something, but I do like the look of having the shaders maxed out. Anyway, that's going to wrap it up for this video. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you guys in another video. Make sure you hit the bell on my channel so you know when I upload again, and you can watch with me. Thank you.